Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode of Farming Simulator 17. Hope you guys are having a good one today. We are heading over to the store right now so that I can pick up this new logging trailer in Dolly that I have and, uh, and try it out. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to back this up and get this Dolly. Let's see, can I get it? There we go. Attach that. And now this will be the interesting part. Now, I can back up a single trailer, but backing up a dolly and a trailer, that's a that's a whole nother feat, I think. So we're going to... I shouldn't have to do much backing up with this. Let's see. Um, yeah, let's go this way and attach. And we just want to keep that kind of in reverse. Uh, so we can fasten tension belts, which will put the belts down on the logs if need be. And then we can kind of drive around and get this thing all loaded up. So I think where we're going to go, I think F1, I can take that away. Yep. Uh, so yeah, where we want to go is I think I'm going to go right up there and kind of start cutting down some of these trees. And we can see how it does uh, with holding them and I think it'll do pretty well it, it's really gonna rely more on my ability to get this um, tractor to to haul them so we'll, we'll have to see here so what I'm gonna do is I am going to switch to the piece here and then we're gonna disconnect and we're just gonna let that trailer sit and then I'm gonna open up this so that I can grab some logs hit number two we can go ahead and chop this one down. It's taking forever. All right, we got that tree chopped. Is it going to fall? Hold on. I don't know if it's going to fall over yet. We'll have to... Oh, can I, like, straight up climb that tree? Are you kidding me? <laughs> I apparently I can I can climb the tree all right so I'm gonna chop down a few more here is there yeah there we go kind of chop it down like this get that in there too bad you can't do like the uh, the wedge cuts or the step cuts and make this just a little bit more realistic and have them like fall the way you want them to fall I'm assuming that you can, you can, you can finagle the fall a little bit, but probably not as much as, uh, as you or I would like. So, let's see, let's get that cut in there. We'll get this one cut down, and then I think we'll have to take the tractor and we'll have to knock them over a little bit. So let's see here, let's, let's get that out. We're going to knock these trees over with the tractor. And we'll just raise that up a little bit and just tap it. That should have it fall down. Okay. And then I should be able to go ahead and clean up these limbs. Just, uh, just clear them all off. Okay. That looks fairly good. I might need to like straight up pick this up here let's let's do that let's uh let's try and finagle this around a little bit better and i bet you we can cut about I'm, I'm, i would say eight feet but i don't know what the in-game eight feet representation is so we'll have to see but we should be able to get that okay we'll pick that up fairly nicely and then just kind of attach that in there and just lift Okay, so with that, I should be able to get the rest of these limbs off. There we go. Okay, and then we've got a couple more down here. Yeah, there we go. Awesome. Okay, so straighten that out. I think like right about here would be a good trim if I could get it to work. So let's see. 
Let's lower that down. See if that helps. Makes a difference at all. I think, like I said, like right about here. Oh, did I see it there for a second? I did. All right, cool. So we'll chop this one off. Awesome. Uh, I think we'll eyeball this one out to about right there as well. Awesome. All right, so we should be able to get these going here now and just have to back these up. Let's raise that up. Let's raise it up. We're, it would be nice to have some weight in the back of this tractor. Let's let's lower that down for the time being and just kind of flip it up this way. It would be nice to have weight in the back of the tractor, but to have the weight out here and have the, the tractor out here and everything, it would just... I think it would be more of a pain that would be, you know, a help. So, let's see. Oh, you know what? We're way off. Let's go ahead. I'm going to aim a little bit closer to this spot. Is that as high as we can go? You know what? That's not bad. And then we could just kind of take it down like that. And how do I open it up? There we go. Not bad, guys. Not bad at all. That was that was not the greatest. Let me don't let me fool you. But you know what? This is actually gonna be pretty good. And then, you know, while all that's going on, these guys are working on the fields. And then I can come over here and I have to start this one as well. But these guys can be working on the fields, passively making us or really passively spending our money. But, you know, somewhat making us money. Uh, let's go ahead and switch this one over to... Uh, I think we'll do wheat. And I should be able to go ahead and hit H. That should be good. And then just kind of drop that down there. All right. And then... Lift a little bit. Oh, Helper J has completed their task. Did they? Come on. Oh, there you go. All right, that works. I uh, don't know what happened there. But kind of just tip that down. Clamp that one in there. Should be pretty good. We can kind of tip that back to get it in there. There we go. All right, so now we have a good grip. We can turn this one around. And remember, we want to aim for that. Really, we should have it aimed a little bit better, but it should be okay. Let's go ahead and lift that bad boy up. It's a little rocky. I should probably do it on a little bit more level terrain as well. But... Get that off of there, slide off, and into the tr into the bed it goes. Very nice. Now, it's going to take me a little while, so I'm going to go ahead and do some more, and I'll bring you guys back uh, when, when something cool happens, or we go to unload these, yeah. And we'll see how it is to unload this, uh, this massive um, log haul that we're hopefully going to have. I'll drop the front end of that tractor down a little bit. Oh, God, what's happening? All right, guys, going to take a load of logs here. You can see I've got a couple of them, not a ton. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I've got them all cut pretty long. And they, they should be fairly good to sell. I'm not entirely sure, like, what a lot of the criteria and stuff is for, um, for selling the logs. So this will be something interesting to check out. Um, but I think, I don't know how I'm going to get them off of this trailer. That is something that seems to be a little bit, um, to be determined, if you will. But I think I've got a decent idea here. So, we've got one of two ways we can do this. We can either try our hand at this, and we, if we unclip them, we can go forward. And then if we go back really fast... And we could kind of work them out that way, but that that kind of seems like it's going to take forever. Now, if I turn that back on, is there no... 
yeah, there's not really a, a good way to kind of take care of that. So another thing we can do is we can go ahead and turn. Let's go ahead and fasten them back up just so they don't fall off yet. And then we can turn this way. And then if I can get this trailer to go to the direction I want it to, which is not the easiest thing to do. <laughs> this is, I don't, I don't know that I've ever had to back something up like this. Like, it would be nice if I could get some, like, stability in this thing. Holy cow. It's darn near impossible to do. And I'm sure there's some of you guys out there that are like, Drax, it's not that hard. You know, you just have to do this and this, and then you're set. Like, you don't have to worry about anything else. And in my head, I can see how this is supposed to work. But it's just not, it's just not cooperating. Okay, so option three, option number three is we will turn this back this way. Okay, just like this and kind of get it nice and straight. Okay, uh, we will change to the front piece here. We will unattach that. Um... Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and reconnect just for a hot second. And then we can undo the tension belts. I did not mean to click through all those. That was not what I wanted to do. No, no, no. Don't disconnect from there. Um, there we go. We'll disconnect from there. And so I should, in all relativity here, be able to... Let's zoom in here a lot. All right, so get that relatively flat. And then we can come in here. What am I hitting on? Just kind of like that. Push a couple of the logs up. And then lift. Oh, well, we paid for one of them. And then if I put that down... All right, we got 1,500. Uh, helper I is blocked. Let's see. Back him up. Oh, that one finished. Okay, I was like, what is going on here? But yeah, this one finished up. We can put him over on this one. And we'll just get this kind of put over here. So we're buying a semi would have would have definitely come in handy. All right, so we'll get that one. All right, so now just uh, kind of repeating that process and getting all of these these pieces. Now I wouldn't mind just coming in, yeah, right like that is something I'm happy with, and then we'll come down and then just kind of line up as best we can. And then clamp. Yeah, we're clamping a lot here. Lift them up. Uh, well, we're getting some of them at least. And then we can sell that one. That's a thousand. I mean, we're getting a, a decent little chunk. And if I had a better way of getting these off of here and, and maybe cutting them and loading them... Um, with one of those crane devices that we were using in the last episode, those things would probably be, like, way, way better for this. There we go. And I think it might be best for us to realign here. Let's go ahead and open up that claw. We're aligned on that side. Good. Kind of just... Get that in there. Open it up. And just kind of lift here a little bit. Clamp. Oh, we got one of them. Put that down. That's another thousand. Okay. 
And then our last one here, we can clip that on. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. And just back that up. All right, not, not terrible. Uh, we definitely could have done a bit better with that, but uh, I'm not, I'm not disappointed in it. I'm not disappointed in it at all. Uh, I felt like it went fairly well. I think I might even leave the log truck over here, or at least the, you know, the the dolly portion. I think I might leave them over this way, probably right in front of this house here. Just like that. And then drive this tractor home. But yeah, I think that was fairly good. All right, guys. So as we bring this episode to a close here before too long, I got to say that um, it's kind of a pain having to drive all these different tractors all over the place. And, you know, I completely understand that that's, that's how it works. But I just wish, like, maybe the pickup could do something a little bit more or maybe... You know, I don't, I don't know how the higher-end pickup works. I might have to test that out in another world. Maybe it can. Um, but, uh, yeah, I think possibly trying to get a semi could be relatively useful uh, because we can get some of the bigger uh, hauling equipment, uh, some of the, you know, that uh, log trailer that we have would be a lot better if we could use the um, use a semi with it. I think that would work out pretty well. But uh, yeah, we're going to be heading off and selling prop or selling uh, soybeans down to Gomez Ridge. Um, it, price of prices have fluctuated a lot in Gomez's Bridge uh, acres. Or ri Gomez's Gomez Ridge acres uh, is the best place to sell right now, uh, as far as soybeans are concerned. And I just want to get a little bit more money going. I think we're doing pretty good at generating. Uh, revenue, but we, we still have, you know, definitely a lot more work to do to be able to do a lot better. So I think I'm going to try and sell this. Uh, then we'll, we'll see how much we get. Then we'll wrap up this episode. And I think from there, we'll kind of look into maybe buying another property um, and getting some more field done work or field work done. And besides that, I don't really know what else. We can let that drain off. Looks like we're going to get probably about 24, no, 22. All right, about nine, about 10,000 uh, harvest income off of that, which is awesome. Definitely really, really good. Uh, we have this that literally just finished up. Holy cow. Could that have done any better in the timing? Oh, we're going to hit the tree, aren't we? Yep, we ran smack into that tree. That was... Um, not how I had planned that, but we can go ahead and I'm going to increase the time just so this field over here uh, quickens up a little bit. But uh, yeah, I'm going to finish this, this field up, let everything else start growing, and I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.